Cool. Fantastic. No, no, very good news. What do you, um, what do you think of the score last night? No, fun was quite a, quite a good score last night. Yes, I mean, I, I think, yeah, but we need to get rid of this violence nonsense. I know, I know, because I, I think... I think there should be no violence whatsoever at any football match. Of course not. What's, it, what's that got to do with football? Oh, basically, it, basically, it spoils. It spoils all the all the enjoyment of the game because if, for 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 example, if if a team doesn't win, there's violence in total. If one team doesn't win, the fight, and that's what we don't want, and that's why. No, no offence, Paul, but, but there's a lot of police out there on every program because of all the fighting and violence yes. and all that. Well, we need to see a lot more uh, joy going on. Uh-huh. You see, and we need to see a lot. No, we didn't win, but it doesn't matter. We had a great celebration with the other side. Uh-huh. So yeah. we all need to get together. We need to stop all this segregation. So you have... Just a pub, not a Celtic pub or a Rangers pub, just a pub. Ah. Uh, you know? Because I think there's a lot more fighting in pubs than football games. Well, there you shouldn't be any fighting at all. I know, I you know. know. Should. I mean, there shouldn't, be, there shouldn't be any fighting at all, you know. Maybe if there's fighting, we should look at bringing a very severe penalty. Yes. I know. You know, no, no, that was a fight after a football game, so they've both been put away for 12 years. Ah, uh-huh. I know. You see, and that would stop it fairly quickly. Mm-hmm. That's the kind of stuff we should be looking at. Like you, like you said in one of your um, previous videos on um, YouTube and TikTok, you said, do you think football should be banned? Yes. Family? Yes, I oh. think rather than have any fighting, just ban it. See, oh, there will oh. never, ever, ever be another old firm game because of the fighting. Because I think, no offence to them, but it's no, I think they're more, I think they're more interested in the money side of it. That's what they're more interested in the money. Well, if they're interested in the money, Martin, they need to stop the fighting. I know, they do. They need to stop the fighting. They, they need to stop the fighting. I've said for years, get rid of Celtic and Rangers and just have Glasgow United. That would put a stop to it right away. I know, but do you do you um, do you um, do you know the reason why Celtic Park and Rangers Park are separate from each, from each other? Is it because of all the fighting? Is is that why they're separate? No, well, no. I think that Celtic probably grew up in the East End, and uh-huh. Rangers grew up more in uh, in Govan. Uh-huh. You see, I think that's where they kind of had their early bases, Park Ed, where uh-huh. a lot of people settled when they came over from Ireland. Yeah. And because the, the you know the poor Irish had been sent out with nothing, you know, and had to sell uh-huh. the shots off the back, they would have gone into the East End where the housing was uh, was it, they were able to get housing. Uh huh. You see, growing up near the river. Yes. Yeah, that sort of cool. stuff. So are you? Are you? Um, are you looking forward to the summer coming in? What?